All right, everyone, and welcome back to your NC Go full body workout. I'm your coach. My name is Jason. I'll be taking you through today. We start off with a five minute warm up, get into our full body strength, get into our full body sprint workout. And don't forget to check online, check on the app for all of our additional tools, like our finishers and our mobility with Dr. Kelly Sarret and the ready state. Now to begin, we have a great warmth in store for us today. If you can, you need a jump rope. If you don't have a jump rope, make sure to check out the ones we have on the NC Fit Shop or we recommend RX Smart Gear, great option. Make sure you have some dumbbells. And then ideally, you got some type of bench or some type of box or some type of ledge or some type of stair or some type of something to step up on for today, okay? Find these items and let's get ready to rock and roll. Now, the warm up starts off with one minute of a cardio of your choice. Then we get into a hundred uh, single unders, which we're gonna use a jump rope. We're going to mount some, some mountain climbers, some jumping jacks, and some hollow rocks. I'll take you through the whole thing, but to begin with the one minute of cardio, I'm gonna just do some basic jogging shuttle sprints, just having fun with it. So join me, let's get ready to rock and roll. We start in 10 seconds. Nice and easy, nice easy jog guys, don't go crazy. Let's go, nice and easy. All I'm doing is just coming down, touching the floor, boom, driving right back up. I hope you're all having a good day. Right now, all I'm trying to do is just get my body nice and warm, nothing crazy. Hopefully you guys have had a good week. I'm not sure what you guys have planned coming up. But hopefully it's all good things. Here we go, 30 seconds. If you guys want to switch it up a little bit, go ahead and come side shuffle it, 30 seconds. Whoop. Bah. Kind of open it up a little bit. Bah. And 15 seconds, we get on our jump rope. Here we go. A little side shuffle, a little quarter squat. 10 seconds. Bah, bah, bah. Five seconds. Two, one. Let's get on a jump rope. I want to thank you all for being here with us today. 100 single unders, let's get it. Nice, easy jumps here. I'm gonna go a little back and forth. I'm already losing count trying to talk. I'm gonna go back and forth, also go regular. What you're thinking about is utilizing your wrist to create this momentum. Let's have some fun while we're doing it. As soon as we're 100 of these, we get into everybody's favorite movement, 50 mountain climbers. Single, forward, back, left, right, right? Switch it up a little bit. So I get a little bit of, you know, a little heel tap. It's having fun. It's probably about 100, I think. I don't know, about 100. All right. 50 mountain climbers. Let's go inside. This time we'll keep our foot off the ground. One, two, three, four. A variety of different ways to do these. You can do side to side. You can touch up right here. Pick what you want. And let's get 50 of them. All right. That's about 50. I lose count when I'm trying to talk to you guys. From here, let's move on to 40 jumping jacks, okay? Ready, set, let's go. Nice work, guys. Right now, my shirt's still nice and dry. By the end, I already know what it's gonna look like. <laughs> Full sweat. That green really shows up. Here we go, about another 10, I think, give or take. All right. And let's lay on the floor, brace our belly, toes off the floor, shoulders off the floor, 20 rocks, two, three, Hold. There you go. 
Brace that belly down. Resist change right now, guys. Get in your 20. And we'll get back on the jump rope. Here we go. I'm really holding it if you need to. Bend your knees this way. All good. Here we go. That's about 20. All right, let's get back on our jump rope. Just finish this sucker out. Nice and light on your feet. Have some fun with it. Get creative here. Yeah, it's like you're a Rocky Balboa, you know? <laughs> Pauline and I were just talking about the last dance with Michael Jordan. <laughs> I haven't seen all of them, but he tells me it was excellent. I think it's gonna get us fired up. If you haven't checked it out, let us know your thoughts. Hit us up, private Facebook group, all kinds of stuff. We got 20 seconds, guys. Let's go. Yeah. Here we go, last 15 seconds. Maybe even speed it up a little bit. 10 seconds. Five seconds, let's get it. And two, one, relax. Awesome job, guys. So right now, for the warm up, we focused on kind of getting our Achilles warm, our body warm, our hollow rock, bracing that belly, learn what that feels like. And now it's time for our full body strength. This one is gonna be every two minutes for 14 minutes, so seven rounds, all right? But what we're looking for is gonna be 10 dumbbell Russian step ups. Now we haven't really done these, so I'm just gonna show you what these look like, okay? You're gonna take your dumbbells, and if your dumbbells are too heavy, you don't need to hold both. You can just hold one, okay? From here, you're gonna step up, right? Now, this would be a normal step up. No problem if that's what you wanna to do today. Or if you wanna do a Russian style, all it is up and then up, down. Up and then up, down, right? 10 of those. If your two dumbbells are too heavy, hold one in the front rack position. As soon as we're done with 10 of those, we then drop to the floor and we do eight dumbbell up downs. Everybody's favorite movement. I say that about almost every movement. From here, jump back, come forward, stand up, okay? Then the last movement, six DB shoulder press. Elbows come in front of the dumbbells, six. So it's 10, eight, and six, okay? We're gonna do that every two minutes for 14 minutes or seven rounds. 10, eight, six. You guys got this? Go identify a ledge, go identify a wall, go identify a box, maybe a giant book, <laughs> maybe not, I don't know. Go find something, and we're gonna get started here in just a second. Whew. All right. Now guys, I don't know about you all, y'all, but I have not done these before, so I am very excited to do dumbbell Russian style step ups. I normally just do regular step ups and don't really do these, and I rarely hold dumbbells with them, so it's gonna be fun. We start in 10 seconds, 10 dumbbell Russian style step ups. If you need to, hold in the front rack. Then you go into eight of those up down with the dumbbells, right? And then finally, it's six shoulder press. Identify weights that are appropriate for you, and if you need to, drop down from two and just go with a single. No big deal, let's have some fun. But the idea here is full body strength. So if it's super, super light, maybe tempo it, okay, slow. We're trying to really feel out the strength here, not so much conditioning. We start in 10 seconds. Whew, this is gonna be a good one. 10 Russian style step ups coming up right now. Let's get it. Nice and smooth. Smooth as your breath. Ah, these are good, man. Whew. Require a little bit of balance. That's nice. I'm right here with you guys. If you've never done these before, I've never done these with weight. All right. Cool. Nice. All right. Ten. Let's get in eight of our uh, deadlift. Woo. Jumbo. Up, down, two. 
three. Almost there. Elbows in front, brace the belly, six. Oh, wow, that's good. Woo, that's good. Huh. Now guys, if you're still working, maybe your weight was too heavy, okay? Maybe drop down to a single dumbbell, or if you got done way before me, maybe increase the reps from 10, 8, 6 to 12, 10, you know, 8. Here we go. 10 seconds, guys. Five seconds, let's get it. In two, one, let's go. Russian style step up. Everybody's favorite new movement. Let's go. Try and get that knee up nice and tall, right? Have fun with this. When it's new, it cannot not be fun, right? Let me say a guarantee. Speaking of new, the shorts I'm wearing are new, and they might have been a little shorter than I thought. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> Eight reps. Seven, eight. Let's go. Keep in mind the stimulus we're looking for is pure strength. Engage. Ah. Ah. Whew. A little faster on that one, actually. So, guys, when we're designing these workouts, we design them with a certain intent in mind. And for full body strength, we're looking to get a full body strength piece. So if your shoulder press is really light, or if your dumbbell is really light, instead, slow down. Get that time and attention will be critical for you. 10 seconds. Everybody ready? Russian style step up. If you need to, Grab that one, hold it across your chest, and let's get it. Exactly the same movement. You're simply holding a single dumbbell across your chest, right? Drive that leg up nice and tall. Nice and smooth, right? Stay balanced in your position. Almost done. And we get on to everybody's favorite movement. That dumbbell. Dumbbell up down, let's go. Eight reps. I feel like I do these pretty often. I think it's because they're so darn effective, you know? Ugh. Almost done. Last one. Six reps. Engage the lat on the way down. Hold it. Ah. Nice. Nice, guys. You know, when we design these workouts, we're trying to think about movements that pack a big punch. If you're gonna do something in here, we want you to do something that actually gets great results. Rarely do we put in movements, or never, that we believe 
Don't produce great fitness. 10 seconds, guys. 10 of those Russian style up down, or uh, step up. Here we go. Ready. Let's get it. What's helping me is hold one side of the dumbbell a little bit more than being right in the middle. I'm not quite sure. Just helps me balance them a little bit better. on these legs. Here we go. Eight up down. Get it guys, get it. If these workouts were easy, everybody would be doing them. But no, we're in here crushing it together. Ugh. Ugh. Almost there. Let's go. Six reps. Elbows in front. Brace the belly. Uh. Uh. Woo. Woo. It's getting real, guys. A lot of work already done. A lot of work already done. Eight minutes in. I need three more rounds. If my math is right. Here we go. If you want to switch it up a little bit, maybe your dumbbells are a little bit too heavy for you, hold it in one arm. Okay? Five one arm. Five the left arm. Here we go. Ready? Let's go. Here. Boom. Same leg, same arm. Three. Just let me try, right? Just switching it up. Five. Now switch arms. Switch leg. Drive it up. There's no perfect. There's no right. There's no wrong necessarily. We're just getting after it. Yes, there is a lot, but there is, there is poor technique, but for now, let's stay focused on the movement. Let's go. Ah! When you receive with your feet underneath your body, hold that. Brace your low back. I know it's tough. Very tough for me to hold that good position, but it's important. Ah. You're going for eight. And six, let's go. Nice, guys. Not sure where you're at on this. But on that shoulder press, be really careful. Keep your belly braced, okay? 20 seconds. Woo! It's getting good. It's getting good, guys. Last two rounds. This is a good one, actually. You know, we test these. We try and create them. But actually, when you're doing them, this, this is great. Let's go. Come on. At NC Fit, we have a whole team that comes together to build your workouts. Yeah, let's go. Almost done with this part. <laughs> Here we go. If the up down gets too hard, right? Remove one of the dumbbells, pop back, pop forward, okay? Lift up. Here, pop back, pop forward, set your back, 
Lift up. Ugh. Be careful for the dumbbell not to lose traction. Okay? If the press gets too hard, elbows are in front, drive your head through the top. Work that full range of motion. Nice, guys. All right. Last round. If you've scaled back, right? That's okay. On this last round, let's fight and see if you can go back to where you started, okay? 20 seconds. If you did the first round, you should go do it on this round too. 10 seconds, guys. Follow my lead. Here we go. 10 reps is what we're looking for. Ready? Two, one, let's go. Last round, and like I always say, best round. Last round, best round. Let's go. Two more, let's go. Ride with me. All right. Last eight, last eight of these. Man, we're not doing them. <laughs> Hopefully not tomorrow either. <laughs> no, we won't do them tomorrow. <laughs> Get eight. Pop up, set the back, lift. Here we go, six, seven, eight. Let's get it. We're almost done. Last one. Step it back, lift. Six. Elbows in front, brace the belly. Woo! Ah, wow. That was awesome. That was awesome. I don't know how you guys feel, but I feel good. I'm looking at it right here. We just did 70 Russian step ups. We did, you know, 50 something, 40 something, the rest. For those of you who are sitting there laughing at me, it's because you know I'm trying to count on the fly eight times seven and uh, eight times six. So we're moving on, all right? We got in our full body strength and that was awesome, okay? I'm already starting to sweat. I'm feeling hella good. Yes, we are from Northern California and we say hella. And uh, you are more than welcome to use the word hella too, all right? Now, we get into a full body sprint workout coming up. We have three sets, 90 seconds max DB man maker. Okay, I'll demonstrate that to you. 90 seconds plank hold, okay? Got it. And then 90 seconds, max double unders. After that, we rest for 90 seconds. So that's a total of three, six minutes each round for three rounds, okay? Um, let me show you, okay? So on the man maker, we're gonna be looking for a push up into a pull and a pull. So we're here, push up, pull, pull. Okay, for 90 seconds. As soon as we're done with that, we're gonna drop these to the side. And you can either hold in the push up or on your elbows the plank. Okay? So this dynamic, super dynamic, in a super static, and then more dynamic with the jump rope. Okay? If you don't have a jump rope or if you can't jump rope, just do some toe taps onto the dumbbells, which I'll also demonstrate through the workout. After that, we rest for 90 seconds. So it's basically 90, 90, 90, right? Good opportunity to throttle, chill on the plank, because you're not moving anywhere, throttle on double unders, and then rest. It's gonna be a unique workout, but we're already feeling the pump from our full body strength. So I'm feeling, I'm feeling, like I said, hey Ariel, I said because we're in California and NorCal, 
we're allowed to use the word hella, and anybody watching this video is allowed to use it too. It's like a, it's like a rule. All right, so let's get ready to rock and roll. 90 seconds, man makers, you and me. 90 second plank hold, you and me. 90 seconds jump rope, you and me. Then we rest, okay? And we're just gonna be chilling. We can talk about life, whatever you wanna do. And then we go back in for three rounds total, all right? Let's get ready to rock and roll. We start in 10 seconds. No messing around. Woo! Man maker time. Let's see how many we can get. Let's go. I like to keep my feet a little bit wider, create a base. I like to bring my elbows into my body, back. Feel my lats really engage, okay? If you can't do the full range of motion in your push-up, that's okay. Drop to your knees and work the full way down and full way up. It's very important that we focus on range of motion over anything else. I don't care if you have to drop down your knees, whatever you gotta do. Working that full range of motion is so incredibly important. Oh boy, this is gonna get real. Now remember, after this, we're gonna have plank. Now if you can, try and keep your hips square, try and keep your body rigid, it's tough. One minute. Now if your dumbbells are too heavy, okay, maybe uh, just do one side. Okay, find a way to scale this out. If you need to, you can be here. Okay, push up, right arm, left arm potentially, if that's another alternative for you. Here we go, 15 seconds, guys. Five seconds. You should be getting the pump. Two, one. Okay. Get rid of the dumbbells. Everybody ready? Three, two, one. Let's hold a plank. Now, right about now, you might be asking yourself, why the hell did I decide to do an NC Fit class today? I'm asking myself that right now. <laughs> but the reason is, is we got to get it in every day. Keep your hips nice and square. If your hips start to sag down like I am right now, try and avoid that. Your hips trying to go really, really high. Try and avoid that too. Try and keep your shoulders, hips, knees, ankles in beautiful alignment. And let's get it. If uh, being on your elbows is too tough, drop to your knees, okay? And get into a push-up hold position. Totally fine, okay? Or hold here. After this, you get onto our double enters. 30 seconds. You should be sweating like crazy. I know I am right now. This is tough. 30 seconds, let's go. <sighs> Too late now to turn me off. You know, you've already gone through three quarters of the workout together. You can't let me down now. 10 seconds. Oh boy. Five seconds, guys. In three, two, one. Woo! Back out real, real quick. Grab that jump rope, okay? Let's fight for double enters right now, okay? If you haven't done one before, go ahead and switch out for plate taps. If you need to do singles, go for singles. Shoot. Here we go, we got one minute. I'm starting late. Here we go, ready? Double enter, nice and smooth. Let's go. Got plenty, whoop, got plenty of time to rest, recover, and get back into it, okay? It's 90, 90, 90. We're looking to finish this in four minutes and 30 seconds. We have 45 seconds remaining. Ready, set, go. Nice and smooth, jump vertically. Thirty seconds remaining. We have plenty of rest, guys. Keep that in mind. Keep going. Oh, man, it's hard to talk. Here we go. Ready? 20 seconds. In three, two, one. Let's go. Last 10. 
Last five seconds. Finish out. Woo. Woo. All right. That was solid. Now, I don't care what you do on your rest. You can sit, stand, walk around, find what works for you. We have plenty of time here. One minute remaining. We go again in six minutes. Hope everybody's feeling good. Those man makers into a plank. Oh boy. That got really tough. Oh. You know, you know, just similar to a podcast, these live follow alongs, you can't make them up, right? You get to really know somebody when they're spending 45 minutes to an hour working out with you. And for me, I just hope that when you guys watch these, you realize that like we're pushing as hard as we can within reason to make sure we're still providing value for all of you. And it's a fine balance that I'm still working on because I wanna throttle, but I also wanna make sure that I'm clearly communicating what we're looking for to you. In a few seconds, we're gonna go ahead and begin again with our man makers. If your hands are hurting because you're on the bar, go onto the hex. I'll demonstrate what I'm talking about right now. Well, actually, you can't do that with a man maker. Two, one, and let's go. If you need to, you can do the push up here, okay? Switch over, drop to your knees. One, two, okay? Push up on here if you need to. Here, man maker, right? Dropping your knees is gonna take a lot of pressure off your wrist that's really hurting you right now. Let's get it though, guys. Let's get it. We got one minute. Nice and smooth, right? Try and get your chest to touch the floor. Work that full range of motion. Get that tricep engaged. On here, what I'm thinking about is loading my lat. Ah, loading my lat, almost pulling it back into my body. For me, that's what I'm working on right now. Let's go. Nice and smooth. Keep going. 30 seconds. Come on. Pull that into your body. We're getting our push and we're getting our pull. It's like the most magnificent thing. Ugh. Ugh. I'm getting strong. Hope you guys are too. 15 seconds, guys. Ready? Let's bang out a few more. You and me. Come on. I know you're watching. You're sitting there and you're saying, I can't do it anymore. Can't do any more, Jason. Come on, get in one or two more. Five seconds. Ah. Two, one, relax. All right, here we go. Find that plank, okay? If you want to switch up a little bit, maybe drop to an elbow, keep your hip high, and switch to a side plank. Don't worry about it. Keep those hips high, though. Ah. From here, if you're feeling good, rotate over and switch sides. Hip stays nice and tall. Ah. All right, guys. Let's see. We're finishing this one at nine. So have 45 seconds remaining. Hold that position. Keep those hips nice and tall. If you need to, switch to center forward. Let's get it. Ah. If I ever told you guys how much we appreciate you, I think so. But we do appreciate you. 30 seconds. Woo, this is getting real. I'm gonna go back to my side plank. Ah. If you don't have one of these NC Fit mats, you gotta get one. Boy, they make this a lot more comfortable, but still uncomfortable. <laughs> 10 seconds. Ah, five seconds, let's go. Ugh. Two, one, let's get it. All right, guys, you know what time it is. If you don't have a jump rope or if you can't do them, here, bah, nonstop, as fast as you can for 90 seconds. Let's go, ready. Nice and smooth.
You got one minute. Now what I'm thinking about, while I'm doing my double unders, I'm thinking about jumping vertically, like there's a string that's pulling me up. I'm thinking about my feet not kicking back, but kicking slightly forward, almost finding this hollow position, okay? Find what works for you, but rotate your wrist and don't use your arms if you're having a tough time. It's all in the wrist, not the arm. You're gonna slam that rope right into the floor. Here we go. Twenty seconds, guys. Fifteen seconds. Let's keep it going. Maybe speed it up. Ten seconds. If you're feeling good at the end of this, maybe try a triple under. Three, two. One. Whew. Now. <laughs> oh man. So I finished it off with a triple under. If you've never tried one, you basically jump high and spin your wrist as fast as humanly possible. And it's a, it's a fun little party trick. All right, we go again at 12, okay? Whew. This is a really weird workout, you know? Started off in that, with that full body strength. Really, you know, I was feeling it, I was feeling good. Those uh, Russian step ups were just different. And then we get to this, and it's just a weird similar, it's just something that, we don't do all the time, that's great. Every day should be similar but different. We want you to feel like you're winning, but at the same time be new and innovative. And that's what we strive for here at NC Fit, between the, the programming team, the writing team, the testing team, and then the team that actually is doing it on camera. So we got a whole crew putting workouts together to ensure that you're getting the best stimulus possible. And if you have ever, have ever had any feedback, just let us know. But by the way, in five seconds we go again. Just wanna let you know. In two, one, and let's go! Ugh. Now when I'm doing these man makers, as I said before, I'm pulling them back into my body for me. If you want to pull them straight up, that's fine too. But I like pulling them back and really feeling my lat engage. I like taking my feet and going wide. I feel like it gives me a better base. You find what works for you. If you need to, drop to those knees, but keep them going. Excuse me, push up. Body in rigid position. Pull back, pull back here, not forward. Here we go. Ah, yeah, baby. All right, we go till 13.30. Let's get it. Ah. Pull it back, feel the difference. Try what works for you, right? 20 seconds, crew. Be careful as you get sweaty. Ah, stay in control of your body. Let's go. Ah, 10 seconds. Boy, we're getting that chest pump right now, guys. Go to the beach, ask what time it is. Three, two, one. All right, here we go. 90 second plank hold. Let's make some money. You know, when I talk about making money, it's about putting money away in that fitness piggy bank. Everybody wants that fitness piggy bank when they need it, but no one's willing to work for it. It's kind of like retirement. Everybody wants a gazillion dollars, but few people want to put the savings away. Same thing with fitness. My daughter this morning wanted to go ride the bike. I said, hell yeah. Let's go crush it. And that's what we want all of you guys to be able to do. Here we go. We go until uh, 6, 12, uh, 18. I think we go until uh, 15. Rotate if you need to, okay? I'm going side plank. 
lifting my hip up, really trying to work for it here. You guys are almost done. 20 seconds. Ah. 15 seconds, guys, let's hold it. Monumental workout today. Monumental. A step in the right direction. Let's go. Five seconds. Come on. Ah. Three, two, one. Oh boy. Speaking of monumental, this is where it all comes to pass. Let's go. Ready. I'm going to give myself five seconds. I'm going all the way to 1630. That's the goal. Here we go. Ready. Three, two, one, let's go. Find your rhythm. Find your pace. One minute. Let's go. Let's get it. Speed it up, maybe. Slow it down, maybe. Oh, shoot. <laughs> Speed it up, slow it down. Here we go, ready? 40 seconds. Take a deep breath. In three, two, one. Let's go. Last 30 seconds of the day. Like you're trying to win. Something. 15 seconds. Let's go. If you're feeling good at the end, try that triple under. 10 seconds, guys. Come on. Five seconds. Let's go. Almost done. Oh my goodness gracious. Whew. Now I told you, when we started today, by the end, you would see some real sweat. Uh, you know, they tell us, try not to try and wear dark colors. But today I wore green. You can see, this is a, a real work. And I know that you guys probably feel the exact same way. So, on behalf of my health, myself and everybody at NC Fit, we want to thank you so much for being a part of our program. Please don't forget to check out the Mobility Tools by Dr. Kelly Surrett and the Ready State, plus all of our finishers and warm-up tools on the app and online. Thank you so much for being with us, and have a phenomenal day.